video is going to be about all about all about unemployment benefits and the LWA that's the lost wages assistance program which is putting $300 in our pockets for a given number of weeks so I'm going to give you an update on the states and the number of weeks and stick around I'm going to share with you over the course of now of uh, the last part of this year what difference does it make whether we get $300 for five weeks versus $300 for the rest of the year versus $600 for the rest of the year. I've got a nice little graphic to show you there. And extra special, I'll show you a view from my window, which is just on the other side because it's a little less foggy, a little less uh, smoky today, and you can see a little bit of Lake Tahoe. Hey everybody, it's Jay Crater with the Rideshare Guy, drinking a little bit of my Vanilla sweet cream cold brew. They have a Starbucks down in the first floor here for the hotel. They don't have room service here, anything like that because of COVID. They don't have coffee makers in the rooms anymore. It's a different world. Everything's changed. All right, let's jump into this. Number one, update on the states. All right, so we're gonna look at a map here. This is the lost wages assistance tracker status. Okay, and even since this was made yesterday, uh, Nebraska, Kansas, and Nevada are all approved. And then you can also see on this one uh, the amounts. So the lighter green is all $300 a week. And there's this looks like four states that are getting uh, $400. Montana, Kansas, Kentucky, and West Virginia. They're getting $400 a week. Good for you guys, drivers out there. And uh, the rest of us are getting $300. Number two, payments have begun. The money has started to flow. So as you can see here, uh, this is my own uh, account and there was absolutely no notification about any money coming into my account. Instead, I just got a deposit, uh, as you can see here, on September 6th for $300. And I thought to myself, wait a minute, I was supposed to get $900 because at that point it was three weeks at $300, $900. So I'm gonna cover in just a second here in this video why I only got $300. Number three, is it three weeks? Is it five weeks? Is it six weeks? How much money are we going to get? It's very confusing. First I saw this article, 300 unemployment assistance gets additional weeks in California as EDD starts issuing payments. Millions of unemployed people in California will now get five weeks of lost wages assistance, okay? Then, just like a day later, uh, EDD clarifies plans to pay out 300 unemployment assistance seats sixth week of LWA payments. Okay, so that's how much money there is. There's enough for all the states that have been approved to get six weeks. So no matter where you are except South Dakota, you're gonna be getting six weeks of your $300 or 400 if you're in one of those four states. Number four, why only $300? Why did I only get paid $300? And how come everybody else was getting paid either $300 or $600? It all has to do with um, when, how you certify. So um, the, the one week at the beginning of this period, I certified for that one week. So that's why I got the $300. So then in two weeks, I believe, I'm gonna get the other $600. And then after that, another 600 in two weeks. So it's kind of coming piecemeal. Um, as you can see uh, from the same article, claimants who submitted their certification for all three of those weeks at the same time, okay, will receive one lump sum. Claim, that's not me. Claimants who did not submit their certification for all three weeks at the same time, the payments will be split in two due to normal biweekly payment cycles based on when you provided your certifications for the three weeks of benefits. So California is doing a little bit different um, than probably your state where you probably just got a lump sum of like $1,500 or even $1,800. Um, so if you're in California, not to worry, it's coming. They're just uh, staggering it a little bit. So as you can see here, I, I, I just yesterday got a notice that I had an, uh, a message and this was regarding weeks eight, one, okay. Um, this payment includes a $300 lost wages assistance federal benefit, okay? So that's why it's just for the one week ending um, August 1st, 
and then I, I believe in two weeks I'll get the other 600 and then two weeks after that I'll get another 600 and then two weeks after that I'll get another uh, 300. Number five, let's do the math. I was just curious to, to see what would happen <clears throat> you know, if I looked at the numbers. So July 26 to the end of the year is 22 weeks. Long time. Because remember, initially the Democrats had proposed $600 a week till the end of the year, right into January. Okay, so if no bump, and I'm just getting the 450 per week, that means over that period of time, $9,900. If we add the five weeks at $300, okay, which when I made this graphic, it was only five weeks, um, it would be 11,400. 11, but now we know there's an extra 300, so it'd be 11,700, okay? And that's what, I, at this point, we can count on. If, we, if it goes all the way to the end of the year, then we can increase that by over $5,000, 16,500, that's 5,100 more. And look at the difference, if this was, instead of 300, it was $600 all the way to the end of the year, that would be $23,100. So, if we compare now 23,100 to 11,400, you can see that's in the range of uh, $11,500 difference. Yeah, that's a big difference. So it's important that we kind of have, have an objective view here. And this is why it's really important. Uh, that's a lot of money. That's a big difference uh, between 300 for, five, for six weeks and 600 all the way to the end of the year. So what are my key takeaways here? Something is better than nothing. Yeah, something is better than nothing. So I continue to have gratitude that we're getting something. It's not what we all wanted. For sure and that still might happen um, but at this point what do we know for sure six weeks three hundred dollars all right so that's it now I'm gonna show you Lake Tahoe all right there's the view okay this is a very tall building as you can see I'm on the 18th floor and there's the lake and uh, it's looking a little blue <laughs> yesterday it didn't look blue at all it looked very uh, hazy, very hazy, but uh, today it looks all right. It's a beautiful day. I would say the smoke factor is about half of what it was yesterday. Yeah. It's really beautiful up here. After I finish recording this, I'm gonna go have some lunch, take a nice walk outside. The air is getting much better today. Um, I wanna say thank you very much for watching the video. Um, give it a thumbs up, that helps for more people to see it. And um, Subscribe to our YouTube channel, set yourself up for notifications, and that way you'll be notified when we have our next YouTube live. Everyone have a great day, be safe, wear a mask. I'll talk to you next time, bye-bye.